welcome back to my channel and if you're new what up so you guys today i'm going to be giving you guys my first impressions and my thoughts on the new kaoli vacay in a bottle miniature set it comes with four mini perfumes and they are all based off different tropical exotic regions so you have marrakesh in a bottle capri in a bottle maui in a bottle and then maldives in a bottle now i know a lot of people were complaining about the size of these fragrances and the price and everything but this is kind of like a trial set this is kind of like a discovery set and i know for a lot of discovery sets Sets, they usually give you a bunch of tiny travel size perfumes and to me those are never worth the price i wanted this because i really did want to experience some of kaoli's summer fragrances like you know fresh and sweet really tropical to go with a lot of my bath and body works body care for the summer that i will be using up so the two that i was really excited about was the lemon sugar which is the capri in a bottle and then the sweet banana which is the um maui in a bottle so this is still cellophane wrapped so i'm gonna open it up and then go through the fragrances and tell you guys what i think first impressions and then i will do a follow-up video to let you guys know after wearing them how i actually feel about them and how they last and all of that so if you guys are interested in seeing that then just keep on watching so y'all can hear me cracking this bad boy open and let's see so very nicely packaged like we would expect this is what they look like up close so marrakesh in a bottle the orange blossom is 24 capri in a bottle is lemon sugar 14 maui in a bottle is sweet banana 37 and then maldives in a bottle is Ylang coco in 20 so let's start with marrakesh in a bottle which is orange blossom which i've seen a lot of people say this is not their favorite and i'm actually going to be spraying these on my skin to get a real feel for them Okay, so Marrakesh in a bottle, immediately I get that orange blossom note. It's the same orange blossom that we have seen in the um, Oriana, Love Don't Be Shy, all of those different dupes. Um, the new peach fragrance from um, Le Mans Gourmand that I did a review on, that is what I smell. It is very orange blossom heavy, but it definitely has that sweet sugariness like the other perfumes like oriana and all of those almost as if it has like you know a sweet sugary or marshmallow note so the scent notes are bergamot orange blossom pink pepper turkish rose neroli and cedarwood i have no idea what the sweet note is in this but it's definitely giving orange blossom sugary sweet now the reason why i'm not in love with this one is like i said it reminds me of perfumes that i already have in my collection i have a dupe of oriana i have that new one from le mans gourmand that also has that orange blossom marshmallow kind of dna from oriana so this one is nice and i do like it i know some people said that this was their least fave out of the set but smelling it it is definitely something i can wear it does not have that screechy note that oriana has it doesn't have that root beer or motor oil smell that love don't be shy has but it is orange blossom heavy so if you like that dna if you like those scent notes then you would definitely really really appreciate marrakesh in a bottle i actually do not hate that one it smells really good to me i just have other scents like it so we're gonna move on to the next one so the next one is capri in a bottle lemon sugar this is the one that i was really excited for so let me spray it on my skin and see how we're liking this one Oh yeah, this one is definitely good. So the scent notes for this one is lemon, sugar, freesia, raspberry, vanilla, and musk. Yes, I definitely get the lemon. I definitely get the sugar. I get the raspberry and I get the vanilla. It is not a super tart, lemony, citrusy, cleaning product type of lemon because of those added sweet notes. There's still a freshness about it. There's still a crispness about it. You know, that citrusy brightness. There's definitely that, but then there's like, I feel like that vanilla and that musk come through so well in this one to give it that sugary sweetness. And the more it dries down, I feel like the more I get that vanilla musk combination, that is so, so yummy and good. It's definitely different than what I was expecting, but that is good, you guys. So definitely so far, that is my favorite, favorite one. Like I said, it's just lemon, sugar, freesia, raspberry, vanilla, and musk definitely feel like i get all of those scent notes together super pretty and super nice so lemon sugar is a go for me moving on to the next one we have maui in a bottle sweet banana so i'm gonna go ahead and spray this one on my skin as well set it right here and then read you guys the scent notes this one is sweet banana pear coconut cream jasmine sandalwood and vanilla so i am expecting this one to have some sweetness as well 
okay this one is really good really really good definitely get that banana and that coconut cream and then there's an airiness to it like a freshness i guess that's from the pear and the jasmine oh but that one smells really really good you definitely can smell the banana in that one but it smells like more of a like banana flower so don't think banana the fruit but more so like the actual banana flower that's what it smells like i feel like that's the fragrance note realm they went in with this one but this one is definitely a go in my book because of that coconut cream that coconut cream really comes in and give it that like sweet milkiness while being tropical yep that one is a go for me as well definitely my second favorite of this collection really really good okay and then we have one more to go which is going to be maldives in a bottle which is ylang coco so that one is rosemary wild lemon star fruit banana blossom ylang ylang and coconut milk don't know what to expect from this one but let us see what it's hitting on okay so this one is interesting i'm surprised a lot of people didn't say that this one was their least favorite i don't know hmm I gotta, I gotta take a minute on this one, y'all. Okay, so when I first smell it, I definitely feel like I'm getting the rosemary and the ylang ylang. It's definitely giving herb, you know what I'm saying? It's definitely giving like rosemary in the beginning. And it's also giving like a cologne factor. I would have to see the dry down of this one. This one is definitely not my favorite. I actually like the orange blossom one a lot more than this one. This one is just not hitting like the other ones. I feel like it has that really herbal cologne factor in the beginning from the rosemary and then that ylang ylang. It's kind of giving screechy. On my skin, I am not loving this one. I will definitely not power through this one the way that I would power through the others. Mmm yeah it's mm -mm. that one is not doing it for me i don't really like it y'all so yeah so far that one is my least favorite but again i have to go through and actually wear it wear it on my skin see how i like it see how it lasts see how it dries down like fully and completely maybe i'll get more of the actual um coconut milk and like the star fruit because right now I feel like the combination of the lemon and the ylang ylang is giving screechy and it, the rosemary is giving herbal cologne and I'm not loving it. So we'll have to see about this one. It's my least favorite. Okay, y'all. So I went ahead and I lined them up from most favorite to least favorite with lemon sugar, obviously being number one, because um, I just had a feeling I was going to like this one. And I really, really do. Same thing for the sweet banana coming in second. I had a feeling I was really going to like this one. And I really, really do. And then the orange blossom definitely shocked and surprised me. This is why I do not like to go on other people's opinions. I like to get things and try it for myself because I saw multiple people saying that the orange blossom Marrakesh in a bottle was there least favorite out of the collection and it's not my least favorite um it can actually it can actually go toe to toe with sweet banana but just me knowing how I am I definitely am more of a fruity or like coconut milk you know type of person than I am just a straight up floral orange blossom um what else did it have in it pink pepper cedar wood neroli type of person I know that I'm more of a fruity and sweet type of person than I am you know the floral so that's why that one is coming in third and then I already told y'all how I feel about Maldives and a bottle so yeah I think this was a cute collection um just something to try like a little trial set to have some fragrances to throw in your bag like I said to mix with other things if you just want to have a refresher perfume this is what you can use and then a good way to try out these scents because who knows what they're going to do in the future if they're going to bring these out in a full size who knows and, and as their own separate fragrances you know so um i'm not mad at myself for getting this collection it's not a dud to me three out of the four fragrances i really like and then i just need to give the other one some time and if i don't like it i can always give it to my boyfriend my boyfriend might actually love the way that that smells so yeah i'm happy that i bought this little set not mad about it not mad about the price not mad about the fragrances and i'm gonna keep wearing them and playing around with them like i said i will come back to you guys with some layering combinations and then like my updated thoughts on these perfumes as i continue to wear them and shoot they might even be gone by then but who cares okay so i hope you guys enjoyed seeing my review of the kali vacay in a bottle set and my first impressions um go ahead and leave me a comment down below letting me know how you guys feel about this set 
thank you so much for watching um if you're new you guys should definitely go ahead and hit the subscribe button join the ferguson beauty army as well as that bell notification so that you can be notified every single time that i upload a video and i will see you guys in my next one peace